Hey guys, how y'all doing? This is Dream Moon Tarot here, here for another reading for the sign of Sagittarius. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Greatly appreciate it. Thank you for those who subscribe, those who recently subscribed, and those who subscribe in the near future. All is welcome. Cross watchers, grab a seat. All right, I won't hold you guys any longer. Thank you, thank you so much for your continued lovely likes, comments, and shares, and continue subscribing to my channel. Greatly appreciate it. There's no time, no gender in tarot. This is why I highly recommend that you guys subscribe, subscribe, because you just never know when you need to hear this. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. And remember, at all signs, um, this could be your person. This could be you. Flip it, reverse it. You know how it goes. All right. So the card that came out for you, all right, um, I had to re-record. All right. Two cards that came out for you first was Seven of Wands as well as the King of Pentacles. Okay. Some of you guys are definitely facing a battle, all right, amongst a lot of people who want your time and attention. However, it's not always good intentions for those who want your attention okay if you get my drift all right so some of you guys are definitely fighting away people that you know that does not do you any good and only does more harm than good all right and that's only because certain people kind of feel that you are a you create good you create better things okay you create good things when you are in peace okay when you're on your own all right when you're not around us uh, surrounding yourself with a lot of people who pretend to want to be in your energy but only just to take what it is that you're manifesting at this time okay stay grounded all right understand that there are a lot of things that you are going to receive all right it may feel as if it's slow motion but it's coming in due time However, you have you are going to fight certain battles that you may not it's, it's gonna be small little battles So it's like a little hurdles that's gonna stop you or try to st attempt to stop you from moving forward when it comes to Connecting with like-minded individuals Some of you guys are losing faith at the fact that some of you guys chose certain people and it wasn't the right idea to choose these people and you stop dealing with certain people because of these people now you feel as though you are there's a whole lot of army against you because those that you you fail to recognize okay um um no longer wants your attention and is turning their back on you okay now you're faced with those who you did give an opportunity to and you gave chances to have betrayed you or have done you no good and now you're up against them okay because you don't want this type of energy around you but now you're trying to find how can you go you know how could you go about a go about you know giving to those you have rejected okay i feel as though some of you guys have rejected certain certain people in your life okay and some of you guys are stubborn as well i feel like some of you guys may be dealing with a taurus all right um a earth sign all right someone who's very you know um bullheaded and strong um and th and that's someone that you need to hold close to you a little bit they may seem stubborn but and this is probably someone that you've rejected in the past. Just know that this person just wants to understand why they weren't chosen to be in your life at the time that they wanted to, be, you know, manifest with you. Okay. Um, let's go. Let's dive more into this. Okay. Another card. Yep. Knight of Cups. All right. Some of you guys, um, it's okay to put your guard down. It's okay to let people know that you made a slight mistake in your choosing. This could be your person who made a slight mistake uh, about choosing you. But there's one specific person that is in your life that is worth fighting for. That is worth explaining something to. Okay? And that's because this person not only... Um, will match your energy emotionally they will match your energy you know like financially materialistic wise but not materialistic wise in a bad way but financially this person also got their things in order okay and if it didn't seem like they were and that's what did not um it, they didn't appear appeal they didn't appeal they didn't appear appeal to you is um only because this person likes to test to see that they're not falling for or going or someone's not falling for them for the wrong reason but for the right reasons okay and to be honest with you that person that you did 
you know, reject, they did kind of feel backstabbed. All right, with this ten of um swords, they did feel betrayed, or you are be or you feel betrayed by someone, okay, that took you for granted, as this person that you've rejected, um felt feels like you took them for granted okay and it only takes an apology and an and, and a slight um explanation you ain't gotta kiss nobody's behind and show them that you know you're you know that you're so sorry and stuff like like you know have some type of dignity okay but it's okay to also be vulnerable and put your guard down and show and express to this person that you had made a slight mistake because you didn't want to um you know, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't know what options to choose. So you don't even have to say that you chose someone else or you chose a different route. Obviously, the person knew enough to be, hurt, you know, hurt by it. Okay, um, and you may be dealing also with the water sign. Okay, some of you guys, this person is definitely with this eight of pentacles is about their money. They're about their business. Okay, while this person after like this rejection it took this person some time you know to get out of that funk okay but once they get out of um funks like this this person turns into like some different type of emperor okay or empress like they about like getting their mind right the you know their their financial financial stability right this person likes foundations to you know their foundation to like if they're starting something for it to be steady foundation they don't want no cracks no loops no nothing into that type of um foundation okay two of cups i see you guys definitely um making up okay and trying to start something into this connection this may just be your twin flame okay something about the way you guys think all right this person may come off as if they're nonchalant that they don't care that they wasn't waiting that they wasn't wondering they wasn't actually waiting but they were wondering why weren't they chosen why didn't you choose them okay and with this death card in the past anything that you're holding on to this past death in reverse you need to let go of it it's only going to stop you from moving forward with this emperor or empress okay this this night okay this person that's come that wants to come in that's been in your um in your energy and you've let down or you let you didn't choose is definitely um is definitely is not for the drama or the bull. So if you're still holding on to past um, baggages and stuff, I suggest you let that go because this next person that you are that you will deal with or that you decide you want to deal with, the one that you did reject in the past, it won't fly with anything. Okay, is it's not that they have a short fuse, but they have a short tolerance for bullshit okay like they, they they don't they don't play that okay at all ancestors angels universe any other messages for sagittarius please and thank you please and thank you oh hold on just a second and the card that came out and just sprouted out was the sun card. All right. This is definitely someone who you can build a future with. There's a lot of happiness. This person will create a lot of smiles in your life. Okay. There's no reason for someone to wake up in the morning and not, you know, text you good morning or ask you if you eaten, if you have any kids or anything like that. They're asking you how are they, you know, just want to know what's up with you. It's, 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 it's far more than just, you know, um the surface this person really wants to get in to the needy greedy and want to understand who are you what is who is sagittarius what makes sagittarius smile what makes sagittarius ache okay this person really want to get into who you are and what you can bring to the table and they know you can bring a lot to the table this is why this person already seen who you were and your worth okay but they loved you enough they liked you enough okay whichever it is if it's love or like they liked and loved you enough to wait for you in energy energetically wise okay they they really did wait for you all right and you'll see once you communicate and voice you know your opinion voice how you feel let this person know it's okay to be vulnerable it's okay to let someone understand that you've made a mistake and you know now what it is to lose or 
or almost lose something great and something beautiful because this person is something beautiful and you are something beautiful and y'all both can make something beautiful together if y'all guys give it a chance finally give it a chance the proper way this time but that's all i have for you guys please like share comment and subscribe